Hello guys, welcome back to the channel. A quick analysis here on HBAR Hedera. I will discuss the imminent short-term price action. Is there more upside possible? And also, of course, my longer-term outlook. Before we start, like this video, subscribe to my channel. If you want to join my trade signal group, click the first link in the description or just scan the code on the right side of your screen. Also, follow me on Twitter, Steph underscore is crypto for the latest updates. Let's dive into the content. So this is the four hourly time frame here for HBAR Hedera. At the moment, I am assuming that the bear market low for HBAR was actually in on the 1st of January 2023 at 3.5 cents. Since then, we moved up impulsively in a wave one to the upside, moved down in an Elliott wave two, came up in an explosive wave three to the upside. And right now it looks like we are moving down in this so-called Elliott wave four correction. There will be one more leg up for H, H bar in this fifth wave to the upside. It is a possibility to label this structure slightly differently. You could even say that the wave three was not even in yet. And we are still, we still have the wave four and five yet to come. And why do I say this? Because each wave also consists of five waves in it in itself. So it is definitely a possible scenario that we haven't even seen the third, uh, the peak of the third wave yet. But at the moment, I am investigating this potential structure. So let's say the wave three was in, uh, then the perfect support to hold for H bar is within this green box. I don't see H bar breaking below the six cent region. Is it a possibility? Yes, everything is of course possible in crypto, but I think it, uh, we have a very high probability of seeing a bounce anywhere in this green support box. So the support box is located, the lowest H bar could go is around 6 cents and the support is starting at 6.7 cents. Uh, we have already, we already went deep into the box here as you can see and something very interesting is happening right now. It looks like H bar is trying to break this downtrend, this imminent short term downtrend because we are breaking Taking above this uh, important resistance line I drawed on the chart and uh, we are right now trying to break above it so that's a very good indication that we could experience maybe a big move very soon for H bar let's see how that will play out um, what is also interesting to see here on the four hourly Bollinger Bands is that we are breaking above the 20 moving average here in in uh, orange and that is uh, very good to see uh, for H bar. So it's definitely uh, gearing up for a big move here towards the upside. I think we could possibly see that maybe even today or in the next few days for H bar. Um, let's take a look at the indicators. Momentum currently pushing to the upside strongly here on the four hourly time frame. Uh, Stochastic RSI is also also trending up and also the MACD is seeing a uh, saw a bullish crossover so the momentum is pushing to the upside for H bar for hourly RSI currently sitting at 54 so a lot of space to go higher from of this point so it wouldn't surprise me if we would see a big breakout very soon for H bar um, let me actually calculate if this correction could potentially be over right now. So if this was the A wave down, if this was the B wave up, then yeah, it is always possible, guys. Be aware, it is always possible that we will go lower, deeper into this area. But yeah, just be aware from any moment in time, H bar could break out towards the upside. A confirmation of a breakout would be a break above, let's say, the 7.2, uh, 7.4 cent region or 7.2 cents. I would even say if we break above 7.2 cents, then we have most likely have a confirmed breakout here. Um, if you are opening any positions here, of course, it's up to you. I'm not a financial advisor, but if you just want to trade this fifth wave to the upside, make sure to use stop losses and proper risk and trade management. Watch your position size and your stop loss, maybe I would say around the five cent region and first take profit could be, uh, let me actually give you the exact price target. So first level we need to break is at 7.2 cent region. If we do so, I can see H go H bar could go all the way up towards areas around, let me actually see, around 9 cents and the target could be around the 10 cents to 12 cents region for H bar. It's very hard to predict the exact uh, target for this fifth wave, but I would say anywhere from 9 to, um, anywhere from 10 to 12 cents would be my price target for this fifth wave for H bar. So that is still the expectations. Um, if we zoom out here to the daily time frame, my view still remains the same. I think from of um, 
Let me grab the Elliott Wave tool. So basically, from off January 2020, HBAR moved up impulsively in five waves to the upside to complete a larger Elliott Wave 1. The top was reached here around the 16th of September 2021 at 57 cents. Since then, we moved down in this bear market in the so-called Elliott Wave 2 correction, which is now completed in my opinion. And right now we are impulsing out of here in this third wave to the upside for HBAR. So very important level to break is 7.2 cents because that is uh, also this downward sloping resistance line which is in play from off the start of the bear market. So we need to break this trend line and it's also aligning in white here with the 0.5 Fibonacci retracement level. So important area to break, but I think the trend is still up for HBAR. So be aware, we could experience a big breakout very soon. And that's my analysis. Please like this video, subscribe to my channel. I want to thank you for watching and I see you in the next HBAR video. Bye-bye.